Yo, um, this is your your boy, fancy uh, no Sauros, you know. Today I want to make something special. Uh, as you probably guys want, you probably know if you seen my what's your name song on description. Like Logic, my fucking idol, dude, my fucking rap idol. I love him so much. Even if he makes bad music, I would still love him and appreciate the work he does. So today I'm gonna make a tier list of, out of him. So yes, we're gonna start, right? So let's start with. Let me take under pressure the last, okay? Cause now nah, I won't say it. All right. So let's edit this. Let's say the greatest of all time. Goat. Pretty. Fucking good or oh, fucking good really good good mm. all right meh bad all right um we're gonna start with young broken infamous I would say this mix is a mixtape, okay? I would say it isn't actually that bad. It's actually pretty alright, so I would put it on. I put it on alright, yeah. I, no, I can put it on. Uh, yeah, no, I put it on meh. You know, it's, it is kind of meh. Ah, uh, and I, I don't know a lot of songs on it, but yeah. It's pretty alright. Uh, I don't have any songs on uh, from Young Book and Infamous. Young Sinatra one. <laughs> this is when, he, uh, when he started to grow up. You know, this is probably one of his first projects. I think uh, where he f there the, when he released Young Sinatra one. That's when he fucking popped up. You know, that's when he became super fucking famous. You know, that's what people know him for, Young Sinatra. So, Young Sinatra one. I would say this one is actually really good. Why? You probably disagree with me, but like, Mind of Logic is fucking good, amazing a song, probably the most addicting song I ever heard from that project. I also like, um, uh, the, oh shit, wait, what's the song name again? Um, I think it's called like Live in the Air or some shit, I remember. Something like that, or, oh shit, um, you mean you know get you get what I mean though. It also, he has Young Sinatra too, which actually does fucking good song too. Like, if you haven't listened to Young Sinatra, then you're not a Logic fan. Like, one is a good song, and shit, he makes a skit also. Don't remember that. Uh, was, I thought I said Mind of Logic, yeah. Are you ready? I think that's also good. Stewie Griffin's gonna good. Like live on the air. That's that's the song I was thinking of. That knife on the air is actually fucking really good. But you think it's a remix of another song from Biggie? I think no, it's not from Biggie. Craig Mack, I think. Yeah, Flava in here. So we're done with that. Now it's um, don't mind the background on here. It's fucking Team Fortress Two. Shh. New video incoming. Hmm. And by the way, I'm streaming also on like Twitch and shit. I did uh, just gonna stream tomorrow also. Uh, when this video is up, probably I'm already streaming. I don't know. Now we're gonna skip this to incredible true story. T I T S, tits. Yeah, I just said it. <laughs> so this album, I would say it is actually pretty fucking good. He has a, he put a lot of effortness and talent in on it. You know, I like my favorite songs on this. Like is uh, the song like whoa. Uh, Lord of Willen, Fade Away, Stainless. That's his, actually is one of his fastest. But then this one t took over. This one, I already know, is fucking trash. Uh, <laughs> it was a soundtrack for his book. Uh, I would say it's, it's fucking atrocious. Fucking bad. Bobby Tartino 2 is actually not that bad. I like the song Midnight and Overnight and Indica something with Wiz Khalifa. That, those are both pretty fucking good songs. So I would put it on uh, really good, yeah. I put it on really good just because of the midnight, because it has a cool beat at the start. 
uh, confession of a dangerous mind. And this is something new. This is one of his latest and newest albums. I would say people would probably disagree with me, but I would say there's two songs that like was a good uh, homicide with featuring Eminem and Confession of a Dangerous Mind. Those are the only good songs. There was also some other good songs too. So I put it on uh, all right. I put it on all right. It was not the good. It was meh. It wasn't meh. It wasn't bad. It was all right. It wasn't good either. Now it's Bobby Tartino one. This one. <laughs> I would say is good actually. Uh, the only song I like on it is Flexicution. That's the only song I like from it. So yeah, I don't know anymore about Bobby Tarantino. Uh, next one is Welcome to Forever. This one is actually really pretty fucking good. It's pretty fucking good. If you need to listen to it, everybody. I don't be okay before I pick everybody everyone says that everybody was a bad bad album probably one of his worst or some shit a, f a fall down or some shit to be honest it wasn't actually fucking bad I, I kind of enjoyed that song I kind of enjoyed the fucking album like Afrikaian if, I, if that's how you pronounce it and America's also a good song everybody's a good song Black Spider-Man Take It Back like Bro, that's fucking amazing songs. So I'ma put it on uh, I put it on good. Yeah. I put I put it on alright actually. No, there's one song that kinda saved it, Afrikaans, so I put it on higher. I put it on good. Undeniable, the two thousand and twelve mixtape. And by the way, Young Broken Infamous two thousand ten. Um, if you didn't know that, uh, let's see. Undeniable, I would say Undeniable is actually fucking gold. Like, it was amazing. I like. I can't say anything more. Like, Dear God was an amazing song, where he talks to God and shit. I like that. Inception is a good song. Fucking the spotlight. Oh my god. When I found the song Spotlight uh, when I was a kid. I fell in love into the song, If uh, then I fell in love into Logic, then I fucking love Logic. So that's a GOAT, the greatest of all time. And now we're gonna put uh, Young Sinatra 4, from 2018, I think. Yeah, uh, and try to go back to the past, like Young Sinatra 1, 2, and 3, like his old school music that everyone just fucking loved, the old Logic, you know. People say it was kinda bad. A lot of people say it's fucking trash, and some people say it's fucking good. I think I know what side I'm on right now. I would say that this one is actually really good. Eh? Is it really good? I like Hundred Miles and Running when he has the uh, Jack the Ripper, you know, you know, Ripper Con, if you know, you know that. And um, goddamn, I had a good bit like an automatic gun here, but I can be a little bit naughty for another person like an automatic. That's a good ass, that's actually really, really fucking good. And then he has, um, oh shit, what's the one called again? Last Call, Last Call, yeah, that's a fucking good song, too. We talked about the story, how he was a little kid, and that what he grew up and years and years ago. It was really good, really good. So they're on the same one, Young Sinatra 1 and Young Sinatra 4. It's yeah, kind of cool you guys can remake the pictures, like, the exact same. Yeah, unless this one though, because he didn't have the thing there. <sighs> the best of all time. The, hands down. You know, uh, Under Pressure, the best album in the whole that uh, he made, dude. This is the best album he ever made. You can't say no. This is the best fucking album he has ever fucking made. You can't disagree with me right now. This, no, nah, like... It, like, this is behind, this is in front, dude. Fucking praise this shit. I fucking praise that fuck under pressure, dude. Ah, fuck. My hand. My finger. Uh, like, under pressure was amazing. It was a fucking amazing song. Like, I'm Gone was a good song. Metropolis, Metropolis was fucking amazing. Bounce was a good song. Bird, I love Bird Alive. Um, 
come on, I have songs in my head, what the hell? Um, gang related was it? Oh fuck! But no, like, don't get me started with gang related the masterpiece. Fucking, that's a master. Oof! Excuse me. Like this is a fucking masterpiece, dude. Like you can't say no to fucking on the pressure, dude. Like nigga, really? On the pressure, you can't say fucking no to that. It's like the best album we ever made. Like if you ask my friend, like. Who is my fucking favorite rapper? Who, which rapper song I rap the most? They will fucking say Logic, dude. I hope so. <laughs> so this is my list. Um, usually people take the fucking twenty minutes to make this fucking tier list. I would just fucking take some minutes. I don't know how long this video is in a way. So yeah, I guess that's it. Though I'm gonna make uh, another one too. Uh, I think I'm gonna make one on. Uh, on uh, oh, what's that rapper called again? Shit, I forgot the rapper's name. I tell I tell guys in the description or some shit. I don't know. Um, you'll see it, probably. No, I can probably make it. Yeah, peace out, guys.